if somebody is um, subscribing to your email newsletter on your website, on your thank you page, why not ask them to also like you on Facebook? If somebody is in the mode of saying yes, why don't you give them something else to say yes to at the same time? Something as simple as that, and I'll tell you what, almost nobody does that. Because I've audited lots and lots of brands and almost nobody does even that tiny little thing. On your email thank you page, ask them to sign up for Facebook as well. And there's about 25 other things we'll go over in the keynote that you can use to tie those two channels together. Facebook is a tool that we use to help people who have given us permission to do so. It's a tool we use to keep our company top of mind. Does that sound like anything else you've ever heard of? That's exactly what email does. Email is used to keep brands top of mind amongst people who have given us permission to do so. Facebook is used to keep brands top of mind amongst people who have given us permission to do so. And that's why I say that email is Madonna. It is the original, yet now somewhat tired and downtrodden. And Lady Gaga is Facebook. It's the exact same thing with a fresh coat of paint. Facebook is so smart, they're so insidious. Let me give you an example. Let me, let me take an opposite case here. Imagine you go to Google and you do a search. And you do a search on former American Idol winners. And Google pops up a, a pop-up box and says, before I can execute this search for you, please tell me where you went to high school, whether you're married, if you're gay or straight, all of your friends, your dog's name, and maybe upload 20 or 30 vacation photos. And then we'll go ahead and do that search for you. That's the way Facebook works, <laughs> but in reverse. We volunteered all this information to them, and now they have all this information. So I'll tell you what, if you're being charged in your company with doing advanced segmentation and targeting to increase open rates, click-through rates, conversion rates, it's going to be a hell of a lot faster for you to get that information from your existing customers who have already provided it to Facebook and connecting those two things together than to say, oh, what we should do is create a 42-field form that we can do more advanced targeting. So anytime you send an email, anytime you send a Facebook status update, anytime you send a tweet or anything else, the chances that any one customer or prospect will see that particular piece of communication is 25% at best. That's a crappy way to do marketing. So the way you maximize your chances is to have a relationship with them across as many inboxes as possible. As many inboxes as possible. Maybe they don't see your email that day because they were really busy and they're just deleting first and asking questions later, but at night, they were on their iPhone and looking through Instagram and they saw your communication there. Or they saw your Facebook status update. Or they saw your pin or something else. Surround your customers with options to interact with your brand, and the chances that you will be able to communicate with them at all go up considerably. 16 different ways in this presentation we talked about integrating email and Facebook. None of them are difficult technically. They're difficult culturally, operationally, and tactically. But your job depends on you doing these things. Because yes, as I said, email's not going anywhere, but social media is sure getting a disproportionate share of attention, and you know that to be true. The money, and the conferences, and the attention, and the media, and the books, and the hype, and the Kardashians. Nobody's talking about what the Kardashians are doing in email. Okay? They're talking about what they're doing in social media and Facebook and Twitter. So if you don't figure out a way for you as the email crew to have a role to play in what your brand is doing on Facebook, guess what?
The Facebook guys are going to walk into your boss's office and say, look, Facebook's much more real time. It's much more dangerous and hot and important. You know what? We ought to just do email. Because if we can do Facebook, we can do email. So either you win or they win. <laughs>